Okay, so here's the aftermath of the uh, capacitor blowout number two. I just have this uh, cord hanging in there and I uh, just shut off the power to my entire house. Uh, this cord completely got melted. Completely melted. So I'm still scared to touch that even though there's no power going to it now. So I have no clue what to do. Oh my god. I'm scared so much right now. I don't know if I could die right now. Oh, it's hanging with that. Who knows that I would never do a fucking capacitor blowout again. I did this in the first place because of uh, my friend's opponent blaster and well, sorry buddy, but I ain't gonna do this again. Look at out there, you. Yay, it's out, okay. Out. Turn the power back on and breathe once again. Oh my god. Yeah, I just had to shut off the, the power to my entire freaking house because of this. And now that thing's out of the wall and I'm not dead, um, I'm going to my messy uh, shed and turn the power back on. Even though I have a big fuse right here that I shut off, I shut off every independent one too, just to be safe. That one I left on. Hmm. All right, it should all be on now. God, you guys, that was scary. You guys better subscribe to that video. No, if you haven't seen it yet, I'll put it in the description. But I really enjoyed the two because, well, I'm never doing that again. And I don't have the money to go buy more surf protectors. I use that surf protector for a lot. I use it to power my amp, my desktop, everything for audio. Hello, Mr. Bird. And yeah, now I don't have it because of blue. Alright. Well, I guess I'll uh, clean up my crap back here. I was actually trying to blow the big capacitor right here. And I had all these to go. But I mean, whatever. Uh, yeah, please comment, like, subscribe. And I'll see you guys.